going on YouTube? We're back with another episode, and uh, uh, AI is taking a little longer because I haven't got it to a point where I want it to be, so I don't think it's going to be up, sadly, this week because, once again, the trip that I'll be away. But, regardless, let's get another kind of request thing done and out of the way. This one is, uh, oh gosh, forget his name. Again, it's the guy who asks... Um, you may have seen him in the comments. He asked about how he always asks uh, what's the next episode going to be, and he asked about how to do different reload animations. So we're going to get into this. We're going to take it. Uh, we're going to take the reload animations that we've got. Uh, I think we've got like two or three that come with the animation starter back. I'm pretty sure there's like a, a shotgun. Yeah, there's a shotgun. There's, there's shotgun iron sights, rifle iron sights, and pistol. So we'll just kind of demo how it'll work with uh, using the shotgun and the pistol as our other two. So let's get right into it. And let's go into our blueprints. And uh, let's clear the search. <laughs> let's go into our blueprints. And uh, we'll make some, uh, uh, the, sorry, we'll make an enum. So g go to blueprints here and get enumeration or enum which is, is a custom list of valuable variables and values that are condensed into, well, a list, or what's called an enum. So let's get this, and it'll be called weapon uh, names. And so uh, just control S and open it up, and we'll do one. We'll do, we'll do two since we only got two weapons, but we'll call AK, AKM. And the other one will be Russian. Can't spell, can I? I say that about every episode is I don't know what I'm doing, and I can't spell. <laughs> and then let's go into our weapon base, which we already have open, and um, uh, create a new variable and call it um, weapon name. And get weapon names. Compile that, save it, and you're good. Get a little bit of lag while you're at it. So now what we need to do before we get into the animations, we need to go to our AKM, make sure that's AKM since it is by default, and then go into our Russian gun and make sure it's called Russian since obviously that's what it is. Now we can close out of both the AKM and the Russian gun. Just make sure you compile those before you close. Now we'll save everything up and we don't need anything else in the weapon base. And now let's go to Bro Dude Anims and let's go to where our reload is. So obviously weapon graph, locomotion, and go to your reload. Now we're gonna drag this back because off of this we need to get blends uh, list uh, blend yeah blends blend list by enum. Now you get all of these crazy 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 just like oh my gosh there's so many different things and some of them are very useful. Like if you're trying to make the uh, trigger finger move, you can do a transform modifying bone and get the enum blend and do the trigger finger and it's like, oh wow, you guys really have this legit set up for me, don't you? And you can do it you can do some really good enum blends if you're trying to do some advanced uh stuff. And you can obviously do other enum blends, but regardless, we have our own enum that we created because we need to be doing our own little thing. So let's get weapon names. So we'll attach it to that. And right now there's absolutely nothing. There should be little thing blend poses that we should attach to. Now I, I don't know if this is a bug or what it is, but you can either uh, double click uh, as pin blend time and it'll uh, uncheck it and check it and it'll pop up. Or you can just right click and add AKM. So I'll do that. And two things will pop up. The default pose and then the AKM pose. So let's just con connect uh, reload aim iron sights uh, or rifle iron sights to that. And then to the AKM pose, uh, let's just get, and I found this out, you can actually search your animations from here. So let's just get reload, um, our, our pistol reload, I guess, for the iron sights. So we'll do a pistol reload for this. And then we will also get our Russian gun and uh, get our, I can't spell again, shotgun uh, reload iron sights. And so, last but not least, we need to set up something that tells us what 
enum we are using. So let us simply go, uh, what was that? Oh yes, I haven't, oh, that was, that would be make sense. <laughs> Let's uh, go here and add a pin called, Welp, this is a familiar one, cast a bro dude. And uh, actually, Yes, cast, sorry, cast a bro dude, and we'll just get the pawn, because that's what he is. He is a player pawn. Now, off of this, we need to get the equipped weapon. And off of the equipped weapon, of course, we will get the uh, get weapon name. And then, off of this, we need to promote it to a variable, and just call it um, reload... pose names something like that set the reload pose names um, which that makes sense because we're getting the names for the poses and that's all you need to do except just drag reload pose names and connect it up to that now of course we can make everything slightly more pretty we can kind of straighten out our connections a little bit or something and uh, go OCD crazy because straight connections are life, straight connections are love. Um, and then compile everything up, save everything up, and now when we play, we should be able to pick this up and let's reload it. And now we see you get that little pistol animation. He, he clipped it kind of to the bottom of his hand. Now let's get this one uh, and we'll switch over to this. And now he's holding it. Uh, I think he's even holding it slightly different, or maybe that's just me. Anyways, let's get this, and now he does the little shotgun animation. So, that is how you do reload animations. Now, obviously, I don't uh, have any friendly animations for these guns, because all of the animations that came with, the, uh, with these models... Actually, nothing came with the AKM, but something did come with the Russian one, and it was purely hands. And, of course, the hand bones, most likely, and I'm pretty sure I double-checked, but they most likely did not match up with the hand bones of our player. So even if I wanted to kind of cut the hand bone animation, blend it with our current stance and whatever, do some really crazy blending, which it's possible, I'm just not the professional at that, and I haven't taken the time to. So if you're good with animations, or you have some specific animations, Animations that are full body animations that go with this character or whatever character you're using and you want to make your animations better uh, like like the uh, this guy wanted this is how you would do it and that's that's all she wrote folks so please please hit that like button it helps a lot lets me know that this helped you and also makes me feel it better better about myself because you know <laughs> feelings bro anyways Enough of the emotional stuff aside, please, please donate to my PayPal, or you can become a Patreon. Patreons or PayPal donators get their name at the end of the video if, of course, I've seen that you've donated. If I haven't and the video went up and you've already donated, I'm so sorry. It's probably because I recorded before you donated. But you will get your name at the end of the video and hopefully rewards. I'm Right now, we're working up towards goals like a better monitor and a much better graphics card. If you want to know what the graphics card is, it's a GTX 1070. So that way you know what price range I'm looking at. The monitor, I'm really close. I'm, I'm actually going to be buying that very soon. Also a new phone. So, you know, Pokemon Go. Um, anyways, so thank you very much once again for watching. Please like, rate, comment, subscribe. Thank you once again for watching. And I will hopefully see you in the next episode. So stick around for some recoil. Because that's the next episode. Awkward ending. <laughs>